are Rob and Tamsin, taking on another crazy adventure, hoping to walk from Minehead in Somerset to Poole in Dorset. At 630 miles, it's the longest trail in Britain. Join us as we take on the challenge of this long and beautiful seaside walk. Last time, we left Minehead and started our walk. We now continue from the village of Croyd. With about 50 miles done so far, we have about 580 miles still to do. sunrise behind us. It's all pretty nice. How'd you feel Tamsin? Not too bad, I want 15 kilos on my back, that helps. Nice to be currently back to that backpack. Yeah. Back We're going a bit light today, or well, just this morning. Yeah. Um, we've left our tent up cool. just to um, do the baggy point bit tent's still up in Croyd, we'll go back after Baggy Point and then pack our rucksacks and head off towards Braunton and Barnstable. And how do you feel about this track? It's taking us around the back of the Saunton Sands and the burrows. At least we're not on the road, but we're not next to the sea. And my ankle hurts. Ankle hurts? I don't know. We should get a support bandage in Saunton Hayley. So like the bit we're on now used to be the railway. Railway yeah. furniture. That's um, it's nice and flat, so we're liking it a lot. Yeah. Um, looks like it's an airfield here. Yeah. But popular with cyclists and people doing the the trail, Southwest Coast Path. Yeah, nice and I flat. Really use the trail with consideration for others. Shabby. Yeah, it'll do. It'll do. It's Tristley Weather. It's uh, Barnstable. We had a good rest. We had a bath last night. Yeah, that's a good. We uh, ate cheap food. And fresh cheese. from Tesco's. And cheese. And little bottles of Pino. And. Uh, yeah, bath was good, bed was comfy, um, drizzling now, we need to head off and get ourselves to Biddeford. Yeah. Onwards! By day eight, I'd come to the conclusion that I had to reduce the weight of my pack. So I had to be ruthless. I reluctantly said goodbye to my colourful yet overly warm and heavy leg warmers. And then I had to get rid of the unnecessary change of clothes and sent them away. I just have to be smelly. 
pretty, pretty puppies. Oh, nothing bright. A grey day. We quickly realised on this soggy day that stopping under bridges wasn't quite enough. We had to get ourselves into a warm cafe, didn't we? Where are you going from? I'm going for treatment. My first ever treating. Very excited. <laughs> Dan goes on after. I only been in the just dead and breathing. I'm so tired. I don't know, it's, you've, you've got a lot of orange and then it kind of like is accented in your like bit so you've got like orange tags on your shorts and then the orange zip on your coat on your camera. <laughs> You're very coordinated. He's in prison. Sloth prison. Teddy bear prison. MOD property. <laughs> so this is day eight. We're just leaving Biddeford where we stopped at Airbnb company room. And we are on our way over towards Westwood Ho. Westwood Ho. We're in Appledore, Tanzan! Woohoo! Yay! Well, look, Still due uh, a bit of breakfast. We need to find a cafe, I think. This is the place of Aria Northern, and there's the information here. Used to be a radar station. Yeah. There's uh, six more doggies to add to your tally, Tamsin. I feel like we are like getting towards the end of that massive estuary walk. Yeah. Um, over there. We can see the Saunton Hotel again. This is the uh, River Tor, Braunton Burrows, Braunton over there. Some more burrows of Northam here. Apple Door. Apple Door. And uh, I don't know where you got. Are we going to do it wet things. sand off your feet? Water. How do you normally do it? Or we'll brush it off? Yeah, but. Yeah, but what? I wouldn't put my socks back on. Dilemma's on the beach. Onwards to the pharmacy to get some foot care products. Squinty face. Sunny! Sunny! It seems to be grey this morning. Yeah, yeah. And blue again. And we're nearly at our campsite. Well. It's like a kilometre away, I think. Where? Over there somewhere. Morning. 
It is day 10 and we're just leaving Westercott campsite. Campsite which has uh, had loads of facilities. Did our laundry last night. Living. Microwave some custard. Yeah, microwave some custard, yeah. We had a three course meal in fact last night. It looked really nice. Which was uh, pasta out of a packet. Um, cheese course of uh, leftover bread and cheese. Yeah. And then warmed up custard while we're doing the washing up. <laughs> it was brilliant. And yeah, so that, that campsite exceeded loads of uh, expectations. A nice little had, shop, didn't they? Had everything, including a little festival down the end. Yeah. <laughs> For Noisy birthday. kids. Noisy kids. Noisy kids, yeah. Um, and farting horses on the other side of the hedge. This <laughs> uh, so is day 10, and uh, we're heading to Cloverly. 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 I thought it was Cloverly, but it's not Cloverly. Because where we stayed. Cloverly. It was uh, Cloverly Road. Okay. I must get that pronunciation right when I talk to Frank. <laughs> um, got an Airbnb book later. But the weather's a bit nasty. It's a kind of misty. Damp. Damp looking. Oh, low cloud. Yeah. Just uh, walking down the hill again to get to the southwest coast path to rejoin it. TTFN! I just don't want to fall down and hurt myself. But you I've, got, won't. I've got a massive bruise in my ass. You've done that already, you're not going to fall down and hurt yourself. Mm hmm. Not if, I, not if I'm careful. I'm also being yeah. careful with my ankle, so. Yeah. Good. Good, steady. Good, good. <laughs> like a graveyard for driftwood down here. What do you normally do with your driftwood? I've been carrying it for a while. Since you bought it for me, probably in um, Keep Martin. Mmm. 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 Looks good. It's not melted. Mm. It's all cracked. Mm. Like a chalk ice. shaped coombe and then um, hopefully our cottage that we're staying in is like on the top bit here I think it is and then mm. that'll be good yeah that'll be good yeah. it's pretty steep given that what this bit yeah and it's all like very shiny cobbles. Slow down. Slow down. Mm, sorry, I didn't say stop, I said slow down. Very slowly. 
going really <laughs> slowly. See that woman? She's already gone down there with her sledge and all her booze. Yeah, and she night. had flip flops. And she had flip flops, yeah. <laughs> They're not like even like rubble ones. <laughs> I missed it. I just need really <laughs> sticky shoes. That's as far as your acid delivery gets you. Yeah. At the top there. <laughs> anxiety. Why <laughs> feel anxiety? Cobble anxiety. <laughs> Cobbles and hills. <laughs> Why holding on to me? Wiping my dirty fingers. No. <laughs> Next time on the path, we encounter our first storm. We check out Heartland Quay and we cross the border into Cornwall. <laughs>